Hey, hello everybody. Welcome to Lennon Scott's Talakinito. See, when I got to say it, I can't say it. Talakinito. Talakayan. Discuss it. So, welcome in. Hello, Lynn. How are you today? Hello, Han. I'm fine today. So, yeah, welcome in. So, to today our... we're going to be discussing uh, about the festivals in Balakan. They're going to have four festivals in January. It sound, they all sound mm -hmm. very interesting. I wish I was there because I would honestly would love to go to one of these. It, it sounds like a good time. And so, oh, wow. uh, so Lynn has got the story for you. So we're going to let Lynn do a little reading and and talking and yeah. chewing gum and walking at the same time and everything. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> but yeah, so oh. me and Lynn are still getting over our cold. So our voices are not. 100 percent but we're we're good yeah. to go we're fighting through it and we're both got a little coughing as she calls it barking so um but we're, we're doing good yeah. we, hope, we hope everybody out there is doing well and uh you know hope you're enjoying the channel we're trying to change it up a little bit things we're talking about and everything like that and so we hope you're enjoying it we appreciate everybody that stops by the channel all the time yeah. and give us a thumbs up if you can we really appreciate that it helps with the algorithms so uh, yeah. so Lynn uh, so, whenever you're ready to start reading and talking yakety yakety <laughs> <laughs> okay so now I will read it uh, uh, for a uh, festival tourists in Bulacan so city of Bulacan Thousands of tourists are drawn to the province of Lakan as three towns and a city celebrate their festival this month. In Ginginto town, officials and residents opened the 26th Halamanat Festival on Thursday, which showcased the locals' love of uh, for uh, ornamental plants, decorated trees, and flowers that have become uh, their source of livelihood. Their, activi their activities line up include the King and Queen of Halamanan, the Parada ng Mga Karosa, Garden Competition, and a Music Concert. The festivity will culminate on Sunday. Meanwhile, the Mayor Christian Din Natividad of the city said the week-long celebration of Pesta Republic was from formally opened on Monday with uh, wedding exhibit and bridal fear. Whoa. So to follow what is, the... What, is, yeah. what, is, what does that mean? Do you know what that means? Are they going to be just like having a, a wedding dresses that you can rent or buy and stuff like that? Are they going to be showcasing stuff like that, you think? Or I you know you haven't been to the festival, but it, it says, says it's going to be a... A wedding exhibit and bridal fair. So maybe it's going to be where you can buy the wedding dresses and uh, all the gowns and stuff like that. That sounds interesting. So all you guys that are getting yeah. married, to, getting ready to marry your Filipina, go down and check it out. Or the Filipinas, <laughs> go down there yeah. and check it out. Find your wedding dress and and then call, the, call mm -hmm, your, yeah. your, your fiancé and say, I found my wedding dress. It's only 10 million. Mm, yeah, like that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and why you join the festival if you're 10 million gowns like that? Uh? Yeah, they usually here in the Philippines, if they have festival, huh? like that, they are, you know, they celebrate the festival and they have a part like with the exhibit, like the bridal here. That's only uh, free for the mayor, like that. And the celebration, they give you a place, something like that. Those people who have a wedding celebration, but they try like that in festival. Okay. For free. Okay. Wow. Well, all right. We'll continue on. So to follow our program, such one barangay, 
one product, Lakbay Kaysay Sayan, Mr. and Mrs. Republica Pilipina, Eskolem Mix, Barangay Day, Dalan, Dalan Santan, part of the festival, the 125th anniversary of the First Republic, that's uh, Natividad said. In the statement, Eliseo de la Cruz, head of the provincial history, arts, cultures, and tourism office, said that this year, Fiesta, Fiesta Republic carries the theme Kali, Kalinangang Malohilenyo and uh, Alab ng Lahing Pilipinas. So it's not for me, it's not really familiar this kind of word because that summer in Bulacan, they are different language. On the other hand, the 14th Minisa Festival also opened on Monday to in coincide with the 107 uh, anniversary of Bustos Town featuring in famous Minasa cookies. The activities line up include the trade fair, uh, Juan Big Surprise Concert, and the Tugtug and Sayawan Alay Santo Nino. Okay, so, so what, on are, January, what are, what are mm -hmm. these Minasa cookies? Have you ever had any? You know, I didn't ever hear that one. All I heard is cookies. Maybe cookies, but that's the language there in somewhere in Malolos, Bulacan. Well, they're so cookies. cookies. They gotta be good, right? Cookies are always good, right? Oh yeah, I don't know what's that kind of flavor. Hmm? Cookies. Do you, so, do you know what uh, one big surprise concert is? Is that? Do you know what that is or no? Uh, Tuk and Sayawan Alay. Sounds like. Because here in the Philippines, usually a festival we celebrate like every devote. That's all the time, like example, Santo Nino, Mama Mary, something like that. Okay. Depends, but, um, that's why they call that one a festival. And, and it depends also the towns, but usually the product there. Okay. On January 23, San Alfonso Town will celebrate its Bulak Festival. It means Bulak like Flowers Festival. Oh. There will be a parade, parade of, of street dancer and clothes decorated with flowers and vegetable fashion out of cotton as well as basketball games. Oh, basketball That's, games. Uh, wow. Mm -hmm. I know That's Filipino the, love love basketball, and then they're gonna have street uh, dancers. Good. You ever been a street dancer? Oh yeah, everywhere. <laughs> no, I never been. Like, like <laughs> it depends. No, I'm gonna wearing the. Really, they they would go. Oh my God! Look at that. <laughs> oh yeah, and then some of most people there in the especially in the that kind of provinces celebrate the fiesta. Uh, Everywhere, if, uh, if, if, even if you don't know that house, if this they ask you, uh, what call this one? You want to eat, uh, you are welcome in to eat there in their house. Oh, really? because, mm, every house is, they have a, they preparing food, they have a visitor, like that. Wow. It's a family bonding, something like that. So my belly doesn't yes, get that. small that way then. It'll get bigger. Uh, especially if the they have minasa cookies. <laughs> I don't know what the minasa Hopefully cookies. Hopefully they're good. Uh -huh. I mean cookies, you know, it's hard to pass up cookies. Oh, it's cookies. Depends on what goes in it, I guess. Yeah. So. And then so while you are there in the what's that? In the street, you can dance. You can, can do dance. This. And you can get a couple of Morocco's. Oh yeah. <laughs> and also, what's that? You can have a makeup. It depends to you what kind of the celebration. Mm -hmm. If they have, that's called, they said like that also, a Bulak festival. It means Bulak, like Bulak, I think. In Bisaya, Bulak means uh, uh, flowers. But I don't know there in Malulus, Bulacan, what's that mean, Bulak? Because in Tagalog also, Bulak is cotton, like that. So I don't know 
what that kind of bulak festival probably means flower like festival. Are, we're, we're talking about a flower fest right something like that a uh, festival but this well, it's got, it says it's got, it said there's flowers and vegetables so so the vegetables are fashioned oh, out yes. of cotton and then they play basketball mm -hmm. Uh, they play the basketball and uh, yeah, you can exactly. eat what you want. Or what yeah. Sounds like a great time. I wish I was there. I, we could go down to it, spend the day, and, and uh, so we had to pause for a minute just in case you notice it. But Lynn is working her store, uh -huh. so we're doing, doing double duties, not a problem. But yeah, I mean, the festivals sound yeah. like a great time. You know, all of them sound like a good time. Uh, wish I was there. We could go down there and spend a day and and see the festival and stuff and eat, try some of those cookies. And you can eat the vegetables. I'll eat the cookies. How's that? <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's <laughs> fine. And also, you can dance in. You can join dance in the street. Yeah. Some of dancers are wearing their costume but even if you didn't wear a costume if you want to dance in the street you can join because they have a lot of assets <coughs> speaker like that or all that one and they have so many people to join that one to celebrate well no we're uh, over in the philippines they wear such beautiful outfits too so such colorful outfits that i've seen i'm sure that the mm -hmm. street dancers are going to be all in in full you know, uh, yeah. costume and stuff, and probably very, very uh, beautiful costumes and everything like that. So, it'd be nice to see it, but maybe next year. Uh -huh. Oh, well. Possibly January, January, February, there's a lot of festival, and me, April, me, there's a lot of festival. Nothing in March. March, I mean, I don't, I didn't care. Maybe they have also March, but mostly familiar January and February. Well, we'll see. We'll April keep, and we'll May. Our, we'll keep our eye on the website and see what's coming up and stuff. Maybe we can plan our yes. vacation that way too. So I hope, um, uh, <laughs> hope everybody uh, enjoyed what we brought up. Four festivals in yeah. January. And hopefully you can make it to one of them or a couple of them and stuff and enjoy yourself. Uh, if you if you heard about it from us, let us know how it was. Hope you, uh, you know, and everything like that. So, again, uh, appreciate everybody stopping by. God bless you all. Have a great day. I'll send it over to Lynn. Lynn, thanks for reading the story. Uh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. So all of you guys hope you like this our topic about the festival somewhere in Alolos Bulacan. And yeah, if you have any uh, suggestion, comment, you can uh, comment down below. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. And yes, till next time, see you our next video. God bless everyone. Yeah, God bless everybody. Bye bye.